da 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 Hey folks, welcome back to Check It With Target. This is season three, so I've lots of new and exciting things planned for this season. Primarily, I took a bit of a break to move the house here. Uh, if you watch the prelude, you can see that I built the house over in this lovely location, which is far away from my old place. And then I put up the foundations for my factory as well as building a nice big backyard if you see it slowly loading here with a rather large number of animals hidden it well roaming inside it there should be some pigs over in this direction yeah there we go there are some pigs I have sheep and cows um, the only thing I think I'm missing are chickens and there are one or two in there some more so what I'm going to do today is I'm going to get started on red power. Now, that's a wiring mod that brings us tungsten and similar things. And for the red power mod, what I'm going to need is actually a lot of bricks, which is something I don't have at the moment. And... It's redstone and iron, I think. Well, first I'm going to go get some clay because I do need a rather large amount of clay for what I'm planning to do today. So, I am going to... that's a generator. I don't think I actually have a furnace, so this is going to be... always forget the important stuff. So, in here, I do have an electric furnace, so that's good get started there and I have some clay with me but first I'm going to teach it to my transmutation tablet which I may or may not have taught it to before anyway and then I'm quickly gonna run over here I'm gonna place my furnace I believe this is a good spot and I'll connect it to my power as you can see is reasonably full and I'm gonna process me some clay into bricks oh, I only need one brick I'll get a lot, but I think I need like three furnaces, so I'll be back in a moment. So I keep running back and forth here. Torted bricks, and I believe four of them gives me a block. Yeah, now I can teach this to that. Have uh, 48 of those. Which is perfect. Because I don't have a crafting bench over here. Why do I always do this to myself? Anyway. What I want to do with red power, as you can see, is I have an alloy furnace. I don't think I can teach the alloy furnace. No, I can't. To the transmutation tablet. So I'm gonna make three of these because I can think of three ingredients that need smelting. So I'll make four. And then while I'm here I might as well get a whole bunch of charcoal out. Because I'm gonna be using that. So I'm gonna travel over here and I'm going to set down my furnaces. Now, you can see they're quite big and they take up a, a lot of room. So, I'm going to first make some red alloy. Which, you can see, is either some iron or some copper and four redstone. So, I think I'm going to trade my 
iron that I have in here. That I have in here. For some... Oh, no. I have plenty of copper. So, that should be enough for one of those. And then... I'm gonna get that started. In this one. With... A stack of charcoal. And then I'm gonna look up... No, I want some red alloy. My blue alloy ingot is silver and nickelite. So, that's four nickelite for every silver. So, I have some silver in here somewhere. And I need some nickelite, so I'll quickly go fetch some nickelite as well. So I need two stacks of nickelite. Now if I can get to the energy level. Two stacks of nickelite. That's perfect. And the last thing I wanted to make in there, I can't actually remember at the moment, but I'll get this going, and hopefully I'll remember while I'm doing that. Now, apologies if my voice is a bit funny. I've got a bit of a throat thing. My throat's been funny the last few days. It's feeling better today, so I figured I'd do some recording and see how that treats me. Oh yes, now I remember the last thing I wanted to make. That would be the... Hopefully that didn't spaz out there. Is a project table. So for the project table, I need a crafting bench, a chest, uh, four pieces of wood, Three pieces of stone. And, well... Four pieces of that. So I don't think I've ever taught the crafting bench to the transmutation tablet, so let's quickly do that. Or I may have. Anyway, the workbench is three stone on top of a crafting table and a chest surrounded by four pieces of wood. And the crafting table is quite nice because it acts like part chest, part... part chest, part crafting table. Now, if I could remember what the last item was that I wanted to make... Anyway, I'm going to take this and fly over here. And pop this down right over there. You can see it's a chest and stuff up there. I'm getting lots of red alloy and blue alloy ingots out. And I have two idle furnaces. So, I'm going to quickly pause this and pop out to my desktop to have a look at what the items that I want to make that I can't remember are. So I'll be right back, folks. And I'm back. And I managed to find what I was looking for. Uh, thank you for sticking with me. It's, of course, I want to make brass. And brass is an alloy consisting of three parts copper and one part tin. And the other item that I wanted to make, which I don't think I have the ingredients for here, but I'll pull that out in a second. So, three parts copper, one part tin, gives me brass. And then the last one is, of course, I wanted to make some silicon buells. So, to make a silicon buell, you need... And... Hopefully this won't take me too long to drill down to them. But... Feather crafting table shows me wood. I want, well, 
if I can get to sand, which I think I can get to from here. Yeah. Well, I'm also going to get some stone. And I want a stack of sand and a stack of, I believe, either charcoal. or coal. I'm not entirely sure which, so I'll figure that out in a second. I might as well get some more charcoal. So, taking these. Now you may also notice that I have these blue torches. And the blue torches themselves are for yeah, it's coal and sand. So, the blue torches are interdiction torches and they stop hostile mobs from coming within a certain distance of them. So if I drop down here, taunt that spider, and go and stand here, and the zombie, and you'll notice that he's not running away from me. And I found the chicken. Hello. Anyway, I'll leave those guys to run around down there. And I'll finish off what I'm doing up here. You can see, I have plenty of red alloy ingots now as well as blue alloy ingots. Now these were made using redstone and iron and nickelite and silver respectively as well as I'm making plenty of brass here using tin and copper as well as silicon buells using coal and sand. Uh, what's the last thing? Oh yes, the very last thing is that I wanted to stick some stone into the furnace to make me some wafers. Now, stone cooked gives you stone wafers. And they have use, which I'll get to later on with some red power. But, since it's gone night and my furnaces have actually finished up, I think I'm going to call the episode here. Thank you very much for joining me, folks. I'll see you next time for some more Check It With Target. Bye.